Hey what's going on guys, this is Ben, or Ben and Jay, and today I'm going to bring you guys an absolutely awesome gameplay. Unfortunately it's not by myself, it's actually from a guy called Victor Gonzalez. I think that's how you pronounce his name, either that or I've just butchered it, I'm really sorry, I'm really really sorry. But um, yeah, this gameplay is incredible, please 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 go into the description and check out the player's channel because, you know, this is only like, you know, a fraction of the gameplays he gets. He is a tank. I haven't even spoken about gameplay yet, but pretty much you can probably tell by the title. This is solo triple nuclear, and um, you know it's in 6v6, so I don't really need to go on and on about how amazing this gameplay is, because you guys are probably smart enough to work it out yourself. I mean, it does take true talent and a little bit of luck and a little bit of skill to actually get this kind of gameplay, because, um, well, you know, it's a solo triple nuclear. Not many people have actually had one of these. But, um, yeah, guys, I guess that's pretty much it for the whole commentary gameplay kind of section of this video. Uh, what I do want to talk about is how people complain, the different aspects of complaining. And uh, believe it or not, guys, but people complain on YouTube. I know, right? I'm, I'm, I'm shocked too. I'm shocked. Um, yeah, that's pretty sarcasm for you there. But, uh, yeah, pretty much people complain a lot on YouTube, as you guys probably well know. Uh, and there's probably some haters on this video complaining about A94 nuclear or A94 raid or how this takes no skill and all that stuff. Where it's kind of funny how everything's kind of, like, progressed, uh, you know, since the early days of YouTube. But like when I first started watching YouTube back in the days of Modern Warfare 2, you know, I used to be the biggest x fan fanboy. You know, I used to love his videos before I went on insane and psycho and druggy. But I remember reading through the comment section and people used to complain about Oh my god, the only reason why I can get these gameplays is due to his connection And to an extent, I guess that's kind of true because his connection was amazing, everybody knew it But obviously, you know, Call of Duty does take skill as much as people like put it down and say Oh, anyone can play it You know, you have to have good reactions, you have to have like good accuracy, you have to have really good decision making So, saying that it's all down to the internet is pretty petty and a bit pathetic to be honest But um Anyway, like, moving on, uh, you know, that was Modern Warfare 2, that's pretty much all people complain about, oh my god, you have good internet, that, that obviously makes you an MLG Pro, that's pretty much like, everybody's mentality back in the day. Then in Black Ops 1, it was pretty much the same thing, people used to complain about, oh my god, you're so sick because of your host, and on top of that, in a pub stomping video, I gotta, like, emphasise this, in a pub stomping video, people used to complain about, oh my god, your enemies are always bad. Like, that itself, that statement is ridiculous. You're watching a pub something video, you're not going to go 100 to 1 against the Mac of J or Fake Raz or, you know, Optics Gumby. It's not going to happen, not ever. And, um, I, I don't know, I, I honestly don't get it why people so complain about that stuff. But that was pretty much it. That was like the worst thing that you could ever say on YouTube, ever. And then when Modern Warfare 3 came along, everything changed. Everything got way more aggressive, it seemed honestly. Like, everybody on YouTube just seemed to have, like, more arguments and. When it came to Modern Warfare 3, people hated support, they either loved it or hated it. I actually really liked it, I thought it was a catalyst for getting gameplays, but a lot of people hated it. Honestly, people really despised it and complained about it in almost every single one of those videos. And um, people still hate the fact that people are using support today, where I really don't get it. Support speeds up the process of getting great gameplays, it, you know, for entertainment wise. You get more kills in a short amount of time, you're getting to see world records, but you're seeing something that isn't possible being made possible. Like, you know, Ben Essentials 300 Plus, and, you know, the Penta MOB and the Hexa MOB and all that stuff. All that was made possible because of support. You can't get that solo unless you're in a hack lobby or something. But I, do, I have no problem with support, and I don't think any of you guys should too. And if you guys are still complaining about it, then. I don't know, just don't watch the videos. If you see something that sounds too good to be true to be solo, then just do click on it, maybe. I, I don't know, that's just an idea. But, um, here it is, guys. Uh, I guess that's pretty much it when it comes to Modern Warfare 3. Black Ops 2 was pretty much the same thing. People complained about support, uh, reverse boosting, PS3. Um, people just complained about the same guns on the same map, which I do admit, you know, Raid was a pretty overplayed map, especially in its prime. It's not so much now, if someone's playing solo, it can be on pretty much any map, but. A lot of the maps in Call of Duty Black Ops 2 were to do, like, they were pretty much made solely for competitive, where for 6v6 and just regular pub something, there was only really, like, slums and raid. That was pretty much it. And, uh, you know, for, like, a YouTube standpoint when it comes to, like, watching pub something videos, it wasn't the best thing. But, um, I don't know, I think some people just need to, like, calm down when it comes to the hair. I'm just making this video to pretty much address everyone who co still complains about these kind of petty things, I guess. And when it comes to Call of Duty Ghost, Nobody cares about gameplay, so nobody really complains. I mean, if you see a pub something video on Call of Duty Ghost, then most of the time in comments people will say, this game sucks, it's terrible, it's boring to watch, yet they still watch it. Like, I, I don't know, for me that seems a bit stupid. But yeah, guys, I guess that's pretty much it. Really random commentary. If you did enjoy it though, uh, then please check out my channel. Um, 
and I guess that's pretty much it. If you guys like really enjoy the gameplay, which I, I'm, I'm pretty sure you will, because this gameplay is pretty awesome, uh, then please check out the player's channel, because it is amazing. If you're new around here, then please subscribe to the Doom Clan channel. You won't regret it. But anyways, guys, have a nice day. See ya.